Please meet Emmerich Genowine. Emmerich is an eight-year-old second grader at Shawnee Elementary. Emmerich is from Liberty Township, Ohio. Mom says Emmerich has been through more than most little boys his age and he has two very complex medical conditions. At three months old, he had his first 60-minute seizure, which landed him in the ER. After five long months, countless ER visits due to ongoing seizures, he was diagnosed with Dravat syndrome, a rare, intractable, and catastrophic form of epilepsy that begins at infancy and proceeds with accumulating morbidity that significantly impacts individuals through their lifetime. Common issues Emmerich deals with due to Dravat syndrome are developmental delays, movement and balance issues, orthopedic conditions, delayed language and speech, chronic infections, sensory integration disorders, and nutritional issues. Current treatment options are very limited and constant care is required. Just when they think they have it figured out, Dravat throws the family a curveball and switches things up. Seizures, triggers, types of seizures, and medications are constantly changing. Then in January of 2021, at the age of seven, and after three weeks of nonstop fevers, Emmerich received a diagnosis of B-cell acute lymphoblastic leukemia. To say the family's world crashed down around them is an understatement. Even though B-cell leukemia is the most common and most treatable form of leukemia, Emmerich is not a normal child. He has Dravat syndrome. His treatment team immediately informed the family that they had treated one other Dravat child, but that child was diagnosed with a different type of cancer, which means a different type of treatment. The doctors began weaning Emmerich off his seizure medication. This is due to negative interactions with the particular chemo drug. Emmerich made it through that. The next 30 days of inpatient induction during a pandemic, Emmerich made it through that also. Weekly clinic visits, unplanned admissions lasting up to 26 days at a time, planned admissions for chemo, chemotoxicity, spinal taps, MRIs, EKGs, days spent in bed, hair loss, weight gain, weight loss, isolation and loneliness. Emmerich made it through all the treatments. Emmerich is currently in maintenance. However, he still has a long road until he gets to ring the bell to mark the end of his treatment. Emmerich brings so much joy to the people in his life. He teaches his family to live in the moment, to think positively, and to celebrate each milestone, no matter how small. He has the most infectious smile and laugh, and he gives the best hugs. And he has a love for all things golf, trains, and dogs. His journey has not been easy, and Emmerich and his family couldn't have gotten through it without family, friends, co-workers, supporting organizations, his doctors, and nurses. Emmerich is the toughest and most courageous boy some people get to meet. Emmerich's wishes include a pool or a splash pad, an adapted bike, a putting green or mini golf course, or a trip to the Thomas Satan theme park. How can you make Emmerich and the other angels' wishes come true? You can become a sponsor on our event t-shirt. We have levels of sponsorship that fits most budgets. No gift is too small and will be appreciated by the angels. Please know that all sponsorship donations made go directly to our angels. The cost of the event on July 30th is taken care of by the Osers, the Ross, and our amazing friends. For more information about our angels, sponsorship, and our event, please visit our website at www.oserrothfest.com.